Hello and welcome to yet another YouTube video here on this channel. In today's video we are taking a look at DEX, which is a personal CRM tool or a relationship manager if you want. And in today's video I'm going to show you a little bit more uh, around how this works. So the first thing you can do is to import your contacts, whether that is connecting your Google, syncing LinkedIn, or importing contacts from different people. I won't do that right now because I can't share all of my contacts on this YouTube video, but there is another way to add contacts. You can actually go onto contacts and you can add one right here and that's what we are going to do. And I will do uh, my uh, co-founder for my clothing brand. I will just give him a random email. So test at gmail at gmail.com and I will add him to a group which is friends and I can add him to co-workers as well. I could choose to add more details so phone number, company and location. I will add the location here as well and we can add him to Dex right here. Uh, so here I can keep on adding uh, things so maybe that's a note uh, of something I want to remember. On the right side here we have all of the different information so I can add his birthday, add a website company education and I can also add his social links right here. So it has Telegram, uh, IG, Facebook, Twitter and LinkedIn. So I could add all of these right here. I could manage the groups and I could add a related contact here as well. So for example, if you have a girlfriend, a boyfriend, whatever it is, and their parents, it could be sort of a related contact. Uh, as I said, there is a bunch of stuff you can add right here. I can give this, uh, give him a title here as well and I can go in and I can start adding notes. So let's say his favorite food was pizza. So favorite, still can't spell favorite food, pizza right here and I could add this note. I could you know, choose to add a reminder for this. So if it is something I wanted to follow up on, I could actually add a uh, Add that as well so that might be remember to buy birthday gift for Kasim. I could add this inside of here. Uh, I can change the frequency of how often I actually want to contact him so it can be every year, every six months, every three months, every month, every two weeks or every week or I could set it to don't keep in touch at all but I will just put it to two weeks for this. And we can jump back into my um, home page right here. Here we have on the right side here, we have all of the different views. So these are, for example, people, uh, people who are designers, founders, future founders, MBA, product software or worked at a specific place. Uh, and these are the groups I just talked about. So if I jump into this group right here, you can see that he appears. Uh, we also have a map here, which goes automatically to uh, automatically to um, the United States, but I live in Norway, so we need to get here. Uh, and you could on this um, map right here also see where your uh, different contacts live. So let's say you have contacts all around the world and in my case, I was traveling to France. I could come into this and I could see if I know anyone in France that I would like to meet up with. And I could add a note about following up with them. So this is a cool looking application. We also do have a timeline view, which is basically just a timeline of everything. Uh, so as it says right here, add it to your timeline where you left off. So this is just a timeline view with different notes. We can add notes from right here as well instead of going into the contact. So let's say I wanted to add a new note about Kasim, I could do it from right here. Uh, so this is good if someone has told you something really important, you can just add it right into the app. 
it also prompts you to follow up with people so every time um, you create a reminder or the way you have set it up in my case i have uh, set up every two weeks for calsim it prompts you to actually go back and contact him uh, as i said you could add contacts from these sources as well and you can even add your calendar into here as well that's if you have a google calendar which i unfortunately do not have we have an import section right here so you could use outlook outlook desktop office 365 even yahoo mac contacts or just csv for your notes i actually use my uh, main note taking app as my personal crm and it works great for me but this is a little more advanced than what i have and what most other note taking apps have of capabilities um so if you're looking for something advanced if you do a lot of outreach if that's a part of your job to get in contact with people or if you're just really really terrible at keeping in contact with your friends i think this app might be really good we have a command bar with different uh, with different keyboard shortcuts as well just so that you know that it is uh, available uh, and you can use it with keyboard shortcuts there are a bunch of different uh, keyboard shortcuts right here and the overall app is looking really cool and really beautiful uh, and it is looking like a great personal CRM if that's something you would want uh, in your life. This is probably one of the best ones out there. It has search functionality, it has the ability to add notes about people, add reminders about people, but the pricing on this is pretty steep. So the DEX CRM comes in at $12 build annually $12 each month build annually you have a seven day free trial that's what I'm on right now so again this makes me think that this is probably better for people that are using a personal CRM to do outreach to get in touch with people I would probably use this for something like my podcast uh and it is probably better for a work environment rather than um, a personal, just a personal CRM. I would also uh, say that the LinkedIn sync also drives me to think uh, that it is more tailored towards those who do a lot of outreach and want to get to know new people and new business people. That's my personal opinion but this works uh for uh, just personal use as well if you just want to uh, stay up to date with your friends and keep in touch with them uh, it works for that as well but i think it's steeply priced for that use case only if you have any questions feel free to leave them down below and i will try to get to them as soon as i can thank you so so much for watching today's video